welcome back to my channel. My name is Pats from Mada Minima. As some of you might know, I've had a capsule wardrobe for almost two years now. And luckily, I've never been very happy with the type of clothes I have chosen. Um, on my minimalist journey now, I have found the type, the style of clothes I want to wear and I am obsessed with the 1940s. Um, but unfortunately, I've never dared to wear this type of clothes because of what might think the other people. But I don't care any longer. I want to wear the type of clothes I like and I feel comfortable in. So welcome to my capsule wardrobe decluttering video and let's get into it. So before we start we just have a look at my clothes. In this drawer I keep all my underwear and no need to declutter this because I have already done it some while ago and this is fine. And in this drawer I keep all the clothes I own. My t-shirts, my skirts, my loungewear, my sportswear. So I will take everything out and put it on my bed and there we can go through it. For those who wonder what is in those two drawers, I can show you, just have a quick look at it. This is my hobbies. And this too, so we won't touch this. We just care about my clothes. I will go through them piece by piece now and decide whether I keep them or get rid of them and the clothes I will get rid of will be donated because someone else might be able to make better use of them than I do at the moment. So I have seven plain white t-shirts with a V neckline. They are still in a very good shape but as I won't wear them any longer, they will be donated. This is something I'm wearing under my dresses, so I will keep it. My two skirts I make myself from a jeans and from a tunic of my mother and I won't wear them any longer. This I wear war, war in the house but the quality was not very good, they were very expensive, but as you can see, plenty of holes, no. So sportswear, I have one, two pairs of leggings, no, I don't need two, I just need one, one short, one. These two t-shirts I will keep because um, this is for sports and this one I keep if I have to work in the house, something very dirty and I want to uh, get my clothes stained. So and then I have these two dresses. 
This one I've recently bought. It's a 1940s dress. Uh, it comes from the UK. And I'm obsessed with this dress. Even Hubby says he likes it. And uh, so this one I will keep. And those who follow me uh, on Instagram know that recently I have tailored this 1940s tea dress. So of course I will keep it. Then I will keep this black cardigan, my 1940s blouse that I bought with the dress and um, a skirt that I've tailored last week. And now let's put everything back into the drawer. So what I completely forgot to take out are these two scarves. Well, I've never worn them. I don't know why I kept them, so they will be donated too. The only problem with my two dresses and my skirt is that they don't fit in a drawer. So I will have to check for an idea or a solution where I can store them. So these are all the clothes that I declutter that I will donate and have a look at the outcome of my drawer. It looks so much neater, doesn't it? As you can see, I kept my sportswear, this white t-shirt for working and this black little thing to wear under the dresses. On this side, we have our handkerchiefs, our envelope system, and some random stuff that I have to keep. Of course, the dresses are not in here. Some of you might think it's a little bit crazy to get rid of all these clothes um, and to keep only two dresses, a skirt, a blouse and a cardigan, but um, I will tailor another skirt and I will look for another blouse so this will make seven pieces to dresses to blouses to skirts and a cardigan and for me this is absolutely enough for this winter time thanks for watching hope you enjoyed this video if so please give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe if you haven't done yet and see you next time bye